Sergeant Key and I reported for duty, and last we left off in the Great Whale Road. We were trying to uh, go get somebody's brother. Apparently, they just don't give a fuck. They don't want uh, anything to do with us, so... the I guess he killed, like, one of the, guy the farmer's daughters, and then the farmer and the village people attacked us, and we killed them, and nothing ever happened. I waited for days for the next part to find the dude, but apparently it wasn't going to happen. So anyways, continuing on, we have now arrived in Sith uh, Sithling. When you arrive at the village, you observe locals making sacrifices to little gods or goddesses. I'm uncertain of your guest rights. You don't want to test your hand. I, I don't want to test them, you know. Looks like these foreign girls, blah, 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 blah. We don't know the customs. Yeah, I feel like we should stand back. Just watch. You camp at a safe distance and keep a few warriors watching just in case of trouble. You know, just gotta keep it good. Play it cool, you know. Hey, bro, I don't want to cause no problems, you know. That's how I, that's how I go. Alright, let's see what this trader has. Oh, he has fucking wood. I'm taking all of, I don't know, I think I needed 10 wood. Okay, which means I gotta get rid of some of this, get rid of that. Uh, fuck this honey, my dude, like, get it out of here. Um, yeah, we're, gra we're grabbing 10 of this wood, because I'm pretty sure I need 10 of it. Is there anything else that I need here? Not, I mean, livestock would be great. A lot of these things would be pretty good. But I just, I, I know I specifically needed wood for one of my things. And that's something I need to I'll carry with me 100%. Alright, uh, so while we're here, I think we should definitely do some hunting. You know, 100%. Just to get a little bit, get our food stocks up. We're gonna stay overnight, get that stuff going. Uh, take all we can. Uh, which is only five. That's terrible. We should have just freaking left. Uh, so Blacksmith, you got anything dank for me? Not really. Not, not really. No, none of this is dank. Not at all. What is this? Uh, oh yeah. I forgot I have this dude that can use swords now that I didn't bring. Um, I mean, there's not really any reason for us to stay any longer. To be honest, I, I wish I could had figured out what the fuck was supposed to happen here. I have no idea, dude. No idea. But I probably, there was probably some mention in the... The description maybe I missed, but uh, that's I guess that's my own problem. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna rest for one night too. I feel like that's pretty important. How much food did that take? Three food. I mean, we're pretty much where we left off. All right, let's set sail. So uh, I'm hoping we make it all the way to the little Saxon area in this episode. We'll have to see though. We never really know. Uh, one of the men notices cooking fire. I don't need to do any of that. That like we don't need to fight. Every time we do this, man, it, it usually usually ends badly. There's no reason we need to go get food because our, our stocks are full. I like there's absolutely no reason. If we can't fit any more food in. Maybe we can fit like four more pieces, but it's it's not worth at all, to be honest. A log ship appears on the river. Both you and the other cream seem surprised by the other by the sudden encounter. Um Yes, afterwards they can tell everyone how they chopped off your empty heads. They don't look like traitors, rather a raiding party. Huh, you stand in the bow and shout a friendly greeting. Maybe you can get some news and trade. You know, that can be friendly but for once. You know, you know, spread the good. It seems they're only in the business of killing. Welp. Fuck me. I thought maybe, you know, they were surprised. They would be a little cool, but apparently fucking not. We're getting in a fight. Hopefully four dudes. That's all I could, like, please be four dudes. I do not want to fight five dudes. Alright, four dudes looking okay. Uh, I hope none of them have the ability to call reinforcements, but I'm sure some of them do. Alright, uh, move all the way up here. And then, way late, I'm going to move you... Hmm... I don't, I want to move them up, yeah, I'm going to move you up here. And I'll move you here for now, because they have, we kind of have to jump across. Even though it's not something I really want to do, it's like, I don't like these shit battles, because they're just, they're, they're hard to like, set up your dudes. Okay, so he can't attack from there. What the fuck? Who the fuck? Oh, that guy attacked me, I was like, are you shitting me? How did he reach? I thought they had like some bow dude I didn't see. Alright, so I think we can attack, like, at least a couple of these dudes. We could jump across. And I think that's honestly our best bet. Yeah, like, I can get up here. 
I can set one dude here. He can jump across. Yeah, I'm going to do that. I'm going to set him here. Okay, and him right here. I'm going to drop her down right here. And then come up to here. I'm going to have her... Can she reach this guy right here? Yeah. 100%. Uh, time to get stabbed the root. Oh, you know what I should have done? I should have attacked with this guy first. Just in case he hit, like, with the... The double blunt smash? Yeah, like that. So his shield's broken? That would have been way better. Uh, and then attack this guy with slashing damage. You fucking... Ugh, that dude pisses me off so much. He misses, like, all the fucking time. Alright. Um. Yeah, we just go with the slash. Alright. Not, not too shabby. Not too shabby at all. I like that. That was pretty damn decent. If uh, this dude doesn't like retreat for his britches, we might be able to kill him this turn. I'm not bad, only 1 HP. 1 HP. I mean, this guy's getting hit a bit here and there. Oh, why hello? You. It seems you have decided to come this way. And what the fuck? Holy shit, my dude. <laughs> I'm getting kind of wrecked over here. Um, well, it's my turn. And I kind of feel like maybe I should do some kind of like maneuver here, maneuver over here, maneuver here, and then try to see. Fuck, he can only move one spot. I dude's quite literally fucked over here. He's probably going down. All right, well, we're going to do our best and try to get this guy down. Oh, not bad, not bad. Uh, and then go for the attack again. Come on, hit, please. Ooh, eight damage. Get fucked arena with my dude. And then we are going to use uh, break shield on this guy. So he's going to have no shield next turn, which is going to be fantastic. Yeah, this dude's gone. Like, no way he is he making it through. Yeah, goodbye. That's good. That's, oh, oh, I did some waylay damage to him. You know... At least I did something before, you know, him going down. He took quite, he took a pretty big hit there, I'd like to say. Oh, this dude's 100%, he's gone. I only have to kill them all? Yeah, they have to come to me too, which is great. Like, after this, like, uh, they, they, if they don't come to me, like, yeah, we'll just, uh, well, I guess, I guess I could move you right, oh, can't she reach from there? I don't think so. Oh no, she can. Which is guys? This guy's more injured, right? Yeah, this guy's more injured. He got pretty wrecked. Oh, he's gone. Oh yeah, feels good. That's what I'm talking about. Those are the battles that I want to happen, like all of the time. Going for the defense points, I see, huh? I feel you. Can you attack? You cannot attack from here. Well, I'll just waylay you then, because I kind of messed that up all right Ooh, nice nice little four damage there let's let's get up over here he can only slash so he's not gonna do any damage yeah he can only hurt the defense points a little I think I'm fine and dandy over here yeah big old miss from you I bet that feels really good um I'm gonna move him down here try to do the little bash Maybe I'll get something out of it. Oh, not bad. Oh, shield broken. Oh, you're fucking dead. Nice. If this hits, she's gone. I think that's a girl anyways. Oh, you motherfucker. I gotta hate this guy so much. I wish I never brought him, dude. He misses so much because he only has one hit. Now, yeah, like if he hits, like it's great. It does so much damage. Like eight damage, like guaranteed on a broken shield. But if he doesn't hit, like he's so shit. All right. Well, you're getting the kill this time. Nice. Ah, I like it. Totally destroyed. I think that went really, really well. I shield break is so good. It will break shield. I love it so much. It's a nice amount of money. Freaking seven seventy silver, dude. I like it. I like it a lot. That that's my jam. All right. That's my jam. You know, he doesn't feel so good anymore. Pretty boned over here, but uh, everything else, not too bad. All right, not too bad. I'm hoping, oh, here we go. Occupied camp, raiding or keep sailing? Um, 
I don't feel like doing another fight, to be honest. We have more than enough food. We can just push forward. Uh, yeah, see, this is just a place right over here. See, we don't even have to worry. Already another one popped up. I didn't, like, a raiding camp, like, what would have been? What have I got? More silver, but my dude's already hurt. I, I don't know what happens if they, you know, if you, some guy dies twice, two battles in a row. Because I know you can get grievously wounded heroes, which probably permanently, uh, just, like, damage them in a way. So I don't want that to happen. So I'm on what, like, fucking Dolophenberg? Something like that? Uh, Dothenberg. Something along those lines. Alright, well, first things first. You definitely, definitely, uh, are gonna need to rest for tonight. 100%. No doubt about it. Uh, what do you got over here, you boy? Rope. I don't think I need rope. I don't think I need any... Well, I could get some food. I mean, we could just send someone on a hunting party, too. Confirm, I think, stay overnight. Uh, we need the... Pre oh, wait, what? You hear bellowing of archers behind a ridge. They are big and dangerous, but they'll take a while to smoke the meat. But their horns are, are priced as drinking horns. The largest one, 10... Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, make that... The pit thing always works. 45 fucking food. That's a lot of food. Uh, 13 is how much I can get. Perfect. Bingo, bingo, my dude. Um, loot. Well, like, it would have been nice to grab that before. I can't, I can't get anything else. Like, that's, we're good here. Alright, so, let's see. Uh, did I, yeah, I looked at a trader already. I didn't look at the blacksmith. Axe hammer, two hit. Here's blunt. Yeah, none of these, like, it's, this is, this is way better. Like, in every way. What about the bear coat? What is that? It's an assault a bit thing? Gives a much higher block chance. But it, it gets rid of, oh, and it adds invasion. Well, this is really good. No wonder it's 600 fucking monies, dude. That's so expensive. <laughs> I would really, really want that, but it's just, it's so damn expensive. How far away are we from? Not far. There might be one more city in between. There might be. We'll see, though. There might not be a city. I mean, but we're, we're swimming, or we're swimming. That'd be terrible. We're sailing on the side of the, you know, of an ocean. A mass of gray flesh collides with the ship. It looks like a huge dead shark. Um... You have, it's hard you ought to, to make the meat edible. Yeah, like if it's huge and dead. Yeah, we'll have to like cure and ferment it. Because can't ferment it on the ship, let it drip away. Yeah, exactly. Like a huge dead, like this hits it. It could be, there could be so many parasites and so many bad things in that. Uh, a campfire? Not really a reason to go to that. Just keep on sailing. Do, 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 do. I think this is where we need to go? Pretty sure. Yeah. So, I mean, there was a little campfire, but really it was, like, not a big deal. There probably wouldn't have been anything worthwhile over there anyways. Alright, well, now we're, like, in the, the main uh, Saxarino territory, right? The main big old Saxarinos that, you know, attacked our... And killed our... Attacked and killed our main uh, warrior forces and killed my brother. Or my uncle? Some shit like that. I don't fucking... One of the two, uncle, brother, something along those lines. All right, let's see what's going on here. After Reaper, even Bargari starts to worry what kind of man Alduin... Oh, he did leave. Oh, see, he did leave Reepa. All right, fucking, maybe I was wrong. This is not where we needed to go. All right, um, you are not eager to find him. You made a promise and you need every sword. Oh, well, dang. okay, so we are still doing the Reaper thing. Or the finding Alduin. Alduin. Uh, when you arrive at Onoleth, you hope this is the end of the mad hunt. A headman welcomes you, and he looks re relieved when you tell him you are looking for a man named Alden. It seems Bagadi's brother has occupied the place. You walk into the village, and Alden is already waiting for you in the front of the hall. Tell him his time is a petty time, and it's ended, and it's time to return him. Uh, I'm gonna let his brother deal with it. Alden talks himself. Talks himself into a rage. Bargadi gives you a signal. Looks like it's time to beat some sense into his brother. All right, fucking. Let's fucking beat his ass, bro. <laughs> Let's just fucking get him. 
fucking the swords and the stabbing. I mean, he's a pretty wild man. Like, let's take him down. Hopefully he doesn't have some kind of backup. That'd be terrible. I feel like he's gonna, though, because if it was just, like, one dude, I feel like that would be way too easy. Holy fucking shit, my man. Fuck me. Oh, my God. Are you shitting me? What kind of fucking shit is this? Oh, no. Oh, fucking no, my dude. All right, well, okay. There's some very obvious things we can do here. I'm just, I'm gonna place these guys down for right now. I mean, if he gets in range with us and we just break shield, he's dead. But, obviously, that requires a lot of things. So, I'm gonna send you over here and waylay. Um, him here and waylay. And then my dude just a little bit up and waylay. Because we have to wait for him to come to us. The only way we're gonna <laughs> just straight up succeed is him he comes to us we move around them fucking break his shield and just start whooping his ass all right and that's how we're gonna get this but i feel like he's gonna just be blocking the fuck it like he's gonna block himself off like just really really bad i feel like he's just gonna be a giant pussy because he knows we'll whoop his ass and that's what it looks like it looks like he's gonna be a huge fucking pussy I can already tell. Look at them all in the back. Not gonna fight us. Oh. What a punk ass bitch, dude. We're so fucked, though. Like, no lie. We are super amazingly fucked. Is that guy's not wailing, right? He's just blocking. Alright. Uh, fucking. That guy's wailing. Alright, first things first, let's let's try to break a dude's shield. No! Fucking didn't want to waylay. Ah, oh, fuck. Alright, whatever. We're waylaying, they have to come to us. We'll move here, and we'll just... Or fucking, we'll, we'll play the defensive move here. They come to us, we whoop their ass, alright? Yeah, you chose the fucking worst move, dude. Quite literally the worst move. Alright, boom. Okay, boom. Okay, we did no damage. Alright, we're great. We did absolutely, and I fucking broke his shield in the first goddamn fucking turn. Or f first fight. Oh, uh, he's dead, dude. There's no fucking way we can, like, muscle through this. Wait. An opening is, arri is ar arising. An opening is arising here. Oh, you fucking bitch around, dude. You're such a huge bitch. I fucking hate. Fucking, I don't give a shit, dude. I'm going over here. I'm fucking attacking you. I don't care. What? Oh, you fucking killed me. Well, rip me. I did not notice he was waylaying. That's my own damn fault. All right, attack. We have we have to go for the big money here, dude. We either go for the big money or we're fucked. Like we have to just focus him down. All right. So far, so good. Move over here. Okay, just attack this guy. There's nothing else I can do. We just, we have to pray. We have to pray. If they don't surround them, next turn we might be able to take them out. Okay. So far, so good. Uh, I don't care if they break his shield. Like, I don't think, they, I don't think they can get them in over here. They can only have one other dude attack. So I think we can win right here. If we hit our attacks. That's the thing. Oh, he broke my shield? What a bitch. Whatever, dude. I don't even care. Because the thing is... Okay, yeah. I'm gonna move up here. Oh, we don't have any focus! Fuck me, dude. I thought we had at least had focus. Why do we have no focus? Because my dude died? Fuck. This is just terrible all around. Alright. Come on. Big money! Okay, we did a little bit of damage there. Fuck it. Come on. Hit him. All right. That's another defense points down. That's that's fine. That's that's perfectly perfectly fine. Oh, dude, they're all gonna dogpile this dude. He's so fucked next turn. All right, attack. Oh, dude. I don't know. This is. I thought we had focus. We apparently don't have any focus though. So that's just absolutely terrible. I mean, we can go for the slash. No, oh, I don't think it's worth it. Yeah. See, broken shield. If we can make it one more turn, one more turn, I think we can do it. Alright. 
Good miss, good miss. Nice, nice, I like the miss. Alright, only one damage. Good, good, good. I don't think anyone else is really going to be able to hit us too bad. He, st he decided to stay in place, that's good. I mean, he, he, he's going to whoop some damage out because he doesn't have a shield. Alright, that guy missed. Is this guy gonna... Alright. Alright. Oh no. Oh no. He's still alive. He's still alive. Alright. He's still alive. This is the... This is the moment. Please, motherfucker. Do not miss. Oh, get fucked. Yo, fucking almost... Not your brother, but almost. I should've used your brother to take you out, dude. I should've, but... That was a risky-ass fucking thing. I thought for sure we were done for. Dude, that was so many people. Like, oh, that scared the shit out of me. Yeah, I showed this motherfucker was up, though. If we had to kill all, we would have 100% lost. There's, like, no doubt in my mind. We would just absolutely got destroyed. I mean, my dude got destroyed. I probably shouldn't have ran him up as a frontline dude, though. I sh that's probably my fault. Yeah, I shouldn't have frontlined him. I need to have him come around the side after they've already decided who they're going to attack. Like, usually the first person that they attack, you're going to keep attacking that guy. Oh, well, uh, so what happened? I mean, we whooped his ass. Really good. I mean, I guess, uh, you need to sleep, right? Yeah. Well, you all kind of need to sleep a little bit. You're all kind of tired. So let's, uh, let's just stay overnight. Oh, now it popped up. So, Alderwin has calmed down and agreed to return home with you. The headman is grateful for you ridding him of Alderwin and his band of thieves. You left Alden on the ship with some trusted men and the villagers invited the rest of you to for a feast. Over drinks and platters of smoked meats, the headsman promises to send barley and oats with you to Ulfsted. Ha! Thank him and apologize for the trouble. Mmm, yes. Alright. Thank Areno. Plus one warrior, plus ten silver. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Quest completed. Feels good, man. Feels good. Alright, um, I think, uh, I think to save, we do need to stay overnight one more time. I think. I mean, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that one more time. Yes, it, it's a little save symbol down there. Anyways, alright, so I'll see you guys next time with many more The Great Whale World to Come. I'm Sergio Kenai, and I'm signing out.